So oh, if you man. are a Workspace customer, you will for the first time have the ability to see usage, users, apps, licenses across your organization. Hey everybody, I'm here at Google Next with the AppSheet team and they released some amazing new features this week. I have Anthony from the AppSheet product team with me here to talk about a very important feature that he's passionate about, the AppSheet admin console. So this is a very uh, kind of management governance tool. Maybe not every app creator is going to experience it, but tell us about it and, and really who is this feature for? Yeah, uh, well, maybe to answer that question, let me take a step back uh, and, and just talk a little bit about AppSheet first. Yeah. Because I think that a lot of the reason that people actually use AppSheet is because they want to rapidly you know, customize and create solutions that are ready to scale. And, and when they build that first app, it's really exciting. It's an awesome moment, right? They, they built it without any code. Right. Uh, but uh, often for organizations that have never experienced citizen development before, that have never sort of allowed anyone to build applications, it can be a lot of challenge, right? It, it can be risky. Yeah. And, and that's really why we built the AppSheet Admin Console because we wanted to provide admins the ability and the tools to monitor, manage, and mature AppSheet innovation in their organization at scale. Amazing, amazing. Okay, so this product is really like almost brand new, yeah. right? A, a total reboot of the app administration experience. So what user journeys did you guys focus on? Who's this built for and, and what are they hoping to accomplish through this new product? Yeah, so we were principally focused on the workspace admin and the app sheet admin. And we we sort of thought about it in a couple of ways, right? There are actually a ton of things that you can do in the new app sheet admin console, but I'm gonna focus on three categories. Right? Okay. So I'll start with the monitoring experience. We thought it was really important that admins are able to answer questions like who is using app sheet, what are they building, and who are they sharing with? Mm -hmm. And so right from the overview dashboard, you can see who are my top creators what are the most popular apps, and I can click into those to see more details about what they built, that usage over time. I can see who they shared with, the data sources connected, yeah. and, and that makes a really big impact. Um, so that, that's the monitoring experience. But we also thought it was important that after you see that information, there's some actions that you might wanna take. You might wanna transfer the app, you might wanna change teams, you might want to set some rules and policies, right? So that's now all consolidated in one place all of your team management, your team policies, your role setting, that can all happen in one place for the first time. And, and finally, right, when you're ready to mature, when your organization's yeah. growing, when many more people are using AppSheet, it, it might be time to look at your license consumption, maybe time to think about your team structure. Right. And you can create new teams, you can set those roles, you can uh, you know, go back to the Workspace Admin Console and look at your license consumption and purchase more licenses if necessary. Wow, okay, so that is a lot of functionality that used to be uh, had to be hand done by some of the AppSheet team yeah. or, or uh, some of the Google uh, support staff. So that's getting rolled into a self-service experience. Yep. That is really exciting. So who gets to take advantage of this? Who gets to use this cool new feature? Yeah, so that was one of the things that I think was most challenging about the experience before. If you needed to set a new admin, uh, you had to contact support. But for the first time, whoever has the AppSheet service setting in or the service privilege in the Workspace Admin Console, they're automatically an AppSheet admin. You also, okay. in the new AppSheet Admin Console, can set those roles automatically, right? So you go to the user summary page and you can set those roles for any user and make them a root admin, team admin, org admin, oh, whatever you Fantastic, that's music to my ears. Yeah. <laughs> fantastic, man. Okay, so AppSheet is available as part of Workspace Core to anybody with Workspace. Mm -hmm. Does every workspace get this admin console experience or yeah. is there a special licensing tier for? Uh, yeah, this is a great question, right? So for the first time, basic monitoring will be available to all customers, right? So oh, if you man. are a workspace customer, you will for the first time have the ability to see usage, users, apps, licenses across your organization. Oh, that's um, a game changer. Yeah, we hope so. Um, and you know, I remember last year when we made AppSheet Core included in most workspace plans, it was really exciting. So much usage immediately. Uh, but then uh, pretty much immediately, we also got a lot of feedback from admins saying, wait, you know, who's, who's using this platform? What are they building, right? Uh, how do I control it, right? And, and so uh, one of our hopes is that with the launch of the AppSheet Admin Console, 
they will actually be able to see and see who's using the platform and be able to manage it responsibly and with confidence. Yeah, so basic monitoring will be included in core. You'll be able to see all the users and apps in your organization. But with enterprise, you get much more detailed monitoring, right? You also get the ability to see the usage statistics, performance profiling, audit history. You can copy and transfer apps between users. You'll also be able to create teams on your own. And most importantly, we just announced a new organization policy feature. Oh, right? wow. And so there are features that used to only be able to be set at the team level and at the account level but now you can have policies that stretch across all teams, across all accounts. Man. And so for the first time, enterprises now have the tools to set really fine grained controls. Some are gonna be across the organization. These are just organization level policies, but then there might be further restrictions for special teams or certain groups of users who you need to control a little bit more closely. Man, that's a lot of power. Yeah. <laughs> so when are people gonna get to experience this? Yeah, so we'll be in preview by the end of the quarter. Um, and so uh, everyone will be able to experience the new AppSheet admin console very, very soon. And then GA probably by the end of Q3. Uh, but uh, I should mention that this is, this is a long-term commitment for us, right? Um, even after we released the first version, there's a lot of other things in the pipeline, obviously a lot of feature requests. Um, and uh, there are a lot of things that we're, we're excited to deliver, right? That we're gonna announce very soon. Cool. Um, and so even in the, after the first version, there's gonna be a lot more controls for admins in the pipeline. Fantastic. Well, Anthony, thank you for your time. Thank you for working hard on this amazing product that we all love. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.